and here we are, the second half of our quest that we've been doing, and Walking Nightmare, I have to go release the Miasma now. So this is about the second half of Walking Nightmare. So there's a lot going on in here. And I just have to make my way through all of this. You're gonna and pay! Get to the goal. Puny weak. These are the quarters. Of course, I'm just a, an entity that they can't even see. I guess, what do they call it? I'm, I'm Ethel. I think this quest is glitched before, but maybe not. It just took a while for it to do it. Um, yeah. I should be Yeah. Okay. I had to restart this game. See the naked orcs? <laughs> they weren't naked before, so I don't know what the heck happened. But when I came in here, they were facing the other way. <laughs> um, all of my NPCs are anatomically correct, so YouTube community guidelines. So I had to flip them over and restart. So, we'll continue on with the quest. The Walking Nightmare. So, I just turned the miasma off. So. It worked. Mara be praised. You vanished after drinking the torpor and materialized on the other side. I've never seen anything quite like it. How I envy you. I can only imagine the excitement of seeing history through the eyes of another. Sadly, I am resigned to just reading of its wonders through my research of the skull. Indeed. My reverence for Vermina's machinations should not take precedence over our mission. My apologies. The inner sanctum lies ahead. We must reach the skull and put an end to Dawnstar's troubles. Lead on, my friend. Come. We must get to the skull and destroy it. So, as you've been reading, my character's breasts are growing out of control. She needs that special armor, but it will interfere with the quest. So. She's just gonna get bigger. And of course, as we move to oblivion with you through the quest, uh, all of these uh, Vermina worshippers are going to be waking up in, in the well done. orcs. Oh, 
Charlie le dit. Il Forgives you, my child. Huh? <laughs> of Mara. You're a traitor. You left us to die and then ran before the miasma took you. No, I, I, I was scared. I wasn't ready to sleep. Enough of your lies. I can't allow you to destroy the skull, priest of Mara. Then you leave me no choice. Never, Never should have come here. Take heed, they've awakened. Ah! I'm on skull must be destroyed. If you'll stand back, I knew Varen and Thoric. They were my friends. Is this punishment for my past? Is it Mara's will to torment me so? First, an incantation to remove the barrier. Call upon you, Lady Mara. The skull hungers. It yearns for memories and leaves nightmares in its wake. Grant me the power to break through this barrier and to send the skull to the depths of oblivion. He's deceiving you. When the ritual's complete, the skull will be free, and then Arinder will turn on you. Quickly, kill him now. Kill him and claim the skull for your own. Vermina commands you. Well, since I've never done it this way, I have to kill him. So, let's do a quick save and see if it's even worth doing. I've never done this. I've always saved him because he's a pretty good follower. So, oh well. Bye bye, Arander. Oh, no. See what this thing is.
Hmm. Interesting. Well, all my other characters that I have saved has never taken the skull, so I guess I'll just stick with it. He's he's dead. <laughs> um yeah, where did he go? There he is. Okay, Arander. I could make him a thrall though. I wonder if I should. Yeah. Maybe I will. Okay, he's a thrall now. <laughs> okay, well, this was my... Uh, just a gameplay through on my new rig. Um, on, on the inside of buildings, it does good. It gets 60 frames per second, so... But when I go outside, boy, I've got a whole lot going on out there. Uh, it drops down to between 30 and 45 frames per second. And when I'm shooting or rendering a video outside in Skyrim, it's uh, it'll get even like 28 frames per second sometimes. But, anyway, thanks for playing with me. See you next video.